Hey there. So, um, I think you might be quite up to date with what's been happening in the political world. I mean, big, big rumblings with Trump kind of getting on to his business. Um, I just wanted to kind of like touch on one of his policies that he really kind of brought in in the last, kind of because yesterday or something when he actually sat down with uh, the biggest car manufacturers in America and actually gave them an ultimatum about, pretty much an ultimatum about bringing up back the industry or bringing back the manufacturing to America. Now, if you think about this, how, um, how, uh, predictable is this kind of policy or, or, or not predictable, but how limited in, in scope? Let's say four years later, Donald Trump isn't there anymore as a president, right? Um, so, you know, American elections work in four year terms. So four years later, an election happens, Donald Trump isn't there. You've got a Democrat government, which is the other party. And they just literally give them give the manufacturers to go ahead to kind of like again uh, pick up the business and go elsewhere. What will that do for the job security? And a lot of people will basically be very happy at this moment in time in America about job security and everything. This is just to give you an example of how unpredictable uh, the times are that we live in, and why we have to be proactive in basically finding a solution that we can really rely on. And that's why I will really recommend you. I'll go ahead, leave a link down there, down below this video, guys. You really need to have a look at this. Because if you look at Donald Trump's policy and look at the reaction of the masses and the people who would have voted for him would have been saying, yeah, that's it, brilliant. This is what he was set out to do and he's done it. Besides all the other things that are really making people huff and puff. But that's, that's a different uh, matter. But we're talking about sorting out a life here and how do you make sure that what you dis decide to do can give you the greatest stability and in my view and if you can defer to it I'd love to hear back from you but when you take your own decisions your mind is subconsciously going to be programmed to take care of whatever comes but if you decide to leave whatever you're basically doing to someone else's judgment and to someone else's command and powers which in this case Trump is basically in command of those jobs that are going to be created in the manufacturing industry in America. Now, if economically, this goes against the economic principles, right? You know, the reason why the industry moved out of America was because the labor, labor was a lot more expensive. And obviously now, then coming back into it will mean that the cars might actually have to be sold at a, at a higher cost, which they really might not actually um, deserve, right? Again, we know there's a reason why American cars Europe, we don't see them so much, do we? we? You know, we know what it is. If you follow car industry, you know which are the best cars. But that's a different debate. This is what I'm saying. I'm just putting these points out there to you to really consider this, really work on this. And I'm telling you, this opportunity down here is what changed me. I'm going to put this link down there and I'm going to ask you to really take the time out and just click the link below this video and try to take your own decisions. Please decide to do what you want to do. This is what it's all about. You gotta kind of stand up and say you're in command of your destiny. No person's policies or no government's policies should dictate what you put down as food on your table and clothes on your kids. Guys, um, I'm just gonna say, really, click the link below. You really wanna check this out. You not you don't only get the one most powerful thing in the world, one of the most powerful industries, which is advertising, but you get paid to advertise your business. Even if you don't have a business, you get to be paid part of the profit shares in this industry. Get click the link below, click the link below, and get on board. Really, guys, you don't want to miss on this. Get on there, okay?